so we're here at uh, Bagram Airfield here in Afghanistan. I'm an aircrew flight equipment technician uh, assigned to the 421st Fighter Squadron here over at uh, Viper Ops. Uh, all the uh, F-16 operations are done here out of this building. I feel like uh, my job is a very important part to the mission that we have here at Bagram Airfield. Pilots cannot fly without any of this equipment. Without this helmet, without any of these types of equipment, they might not be able to fly safely. They wouldn't be able to communicate because the helmet itself provides a means for them to communicate with not only other fighter pilots, but also other assets that are out there. And it's a great feeling when a, you know, a pilot comes up to you and uh, thanks you for what you do uh, so that that individual can go to his or her husband, wife, uh, and their kids. You know, it's an awesome feeling. Preparing all the uh, equipment for the pilots is a good feeling. Uh, we're dealing with a lot of the equipment that they would be um, unable to fly without. So their helmets, making sure that uh, their heads-up display works correctly because that's what they'll be using to see everything. Making sure that their G-suit works properly so there's no danger there. If they start to pull Gs, they're protected properly. All right, so what we have here is the ACES-2 style parachute system. What I simply do here uh, before we hand these off to our egress brethren is uh, ensure that it's got a good date. We check the 391 to ensure that it has been inspected and uh, meets the requirements, at least the time requirement, for how long we need this parachute to be inside the F-16, uh, inside the aircraft. Um, so after checking the dates and ensuring that it's good, uh, we just do a quick look over ensure that uh, none of the tackings or anything associated with the parachute system itself is uh, missing, broken, or anything like that. Uh, ensure that the correct parachute, uh, such as uh, CO9, it matches the 391, so we know we're, we're given the correct parachute to uh, egress before we ship it out because we are responsible for this life-saving device. This is one thing that we, uh, we do take very seriously because uh, in the event that a pilot has to eject out of an aircraft, this is the only thing that's going to save his life. Uh, this is what's going to bring him or her down to earth. And uh, thankfully, it has been proven to work. Uh, we have been uh, a part of an ejection within the past four years. And uh, thankfully, that pilot was actually able to go home to his wife and kids. And uh, you know, it's one of the great feelings about uh, taking care of this type of equipment. So something we take a lot of pride in in uh, the aircrew flight equipment career field. Uh, with these guys meeting the ground commander's intent and putting bombs on target is very awesome to see. One thing that I think is very crucial about our job is it plays a big role in the fight that we perform here out at Bagram. We still have a job that we perform uh, that gets these guys off the ground every single day. We'll make it darker or um, 